What's going on? It's like I give up here. And today I'm gonna be trying another challenge. A while ago I tried the three elixir challenge. So today I'll be trying the four elixir one. So this was the deck that I made. It seems okay, I made it in a rush, so I'll change a couple of things. We have two major tank killers, that being the Inferno Dragon and the Mini Pekka. We also have the spell which is the Fireball, and we also have a Hog. I probably need more air, so if we take a look at the four elixir cards, I think the Electro Wizard will be good. So we use that instead of the Mortar. Then we have a lot of other ground, but I feel like overall this should be okay. Again, this, this is only four licks, so we don't have much cycle, so every card has to be an important yeah, it has to be important in this. So without much thought, I guess we just go into it. So currently I'm at 4012 trophies or 4k around there. So I'll be trying that. Oh, uh, I'll quickly use my request. Want that level 10 fireball? And in we go. <clears throat> So he's only a level 11, so he shouldn't have two high level cards. My main big cards would probably be the Fireball and the... Uh, what do we call it? The uh, Valkyrie. So the Dark Pit soon. I'll bet that with the Hog. And um, maybe a pre Fireball. If I feel like so. <clears throat> yeah, Ooh, this is gonna be a... I'm gonna have to Fireball now. It's it's sad to see a uh, move like that, but what can you do? I don't know. Well, he's definitely got a lot of damage on me there. That's going to be a tough one to fight back. I did have 300 more health than him, so that's my advantage, I guess. But considering I'm not using a real deck, it's going to be interesting to see where this goes. Ooh. Also, in case you didn't know, you can check out how I got 12 wins on the Magic Archer Challenge. It's only level 1, which is like tournament standard, which isn't really good at 4k. And the Magic Archer, oh, this guy seems surprised. <laughs> the, I mean, overall, the Magic Archer isn't amazing. He's pretty bad to be brutally honest. Like, you could get something a lot better. That mini pecker should just be about to take him out. Okay. Ooh, I'm gonna take damage heavy on both sides. But I should be able to push out this tower here. Hmm. Probably if he electro wizards, I'll probably be able to get a fireball in. Electro wizard. And that head should do nice amount of damage. Maybe once I level up my Magic Archer, he'll be more use. He's he's a good combo with Tornado. I think Orange Juice made a nice video about it, which I think is a uh, it, it's very clean. Like it, no, he definitely knows what he's talking about. Unlike me, who's just like, yeah, let's just push him. Out. So we have that tornado. Oh no, that was bad placement. Somehow got him. Ooh, that is. I mean, I a minimum the time, I'm not nothing to do, what are doing? My time is very rough to do. I need to get that tower down. Oh, oh dear me, he's not holding back. This tower is 100%. I want at least a single crown for a crown chase, but... Yeah, there's no way I was doing that. Oh, goodness. It, it, was, it was well played by him. Gotta give it to him. <clears throat> I think from that there's an easy learning thing there. Air is a big problem. And I think with a deck like this, tornado is something that we need badly. Nope. I already got the ch um whatever you call it. What what do you call these now? Challenge no no the li the league? My draft chest, whatever that is. I, I got my draft chest, so it's okay. So the Magic Archer was a big, big letdown. But I feel like there was... Maybe I don't need both of the Valkyrie and the Dark Prince, considering they have similar roles. Again, only four elixirs, so... Hmm. The Night Witch is very effective. Her bat spawning mechanism is quite useful. 
something you could use very well. And, 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 and. I'm thinking maybe a building to get a good distraction in. Yeah, considering I'm always placing stuff down. So maybe go with the either the Tesla or the mortar. Hmm. I mean, it's gonna have to be Tesla if I want to damage, but damage doing building. Yeah. By the way, second battle. Here we go. Let's see how this does. Okay, first we'll push through the hole. As you do, oh, got lucky there. Now, now, now. I'll probably hit the Valky over here. Good distraction. Oh, that's a different thing to do. I was hoping to get my uh, thousand to your time. Oh well. Now, with that going on. Oh, tanking for the. Oh, actually, this isn't too bad of a move. I mean, everything's dead now, but... Hey, nice amount of damage there. Oh, we'll put this Tesla here. No, uh, I really wish the Tesla would stun. Even if it was like a split second, like, it would definitely make it more viable as a card. But then I feel like that would overrule the use of the cannon. And I guess bomb power just wouldn't get any love. I think an easy way to fix the bomb tower, it's 5 elixir, right? So instead of making it do damage, give it like a mechanic as well, so like, it does a little bit of, um, I forgot what it's called. Uh, splashback, whatever, like, like what the fireball is. A bit, uh, something like that would be useful. Oh, uh, don't stop it. Oh, uh, that's gonna be heavy, oh well. Not too much I can do there. Again, with everything being four elixir, uh, the max I could put down is two cards at once. I didn't work with him. Oh, I'm gonna try to do this. I wanna be able to hold back on my spending. Okay, probably. Um, so probably. Oh, he did it. I was actually. Yeah, yeah, there, there's the prince. There's no easy way of stopping this. I don't know if I'm going to do I don't know if I can do my deal. I'm definitely losing this tower sometime soon. Unless I can get this tower going in. Oh, you know what? That, that was very lucky, I'm going to be honest. That wasn't what I had in mind. Oh, yes, Valkyrie. Come on. Buffed Valkyrie, yes. I was not expecting that. We're gonna put you in there. We're gonna put this in here. We need to find a way of stopping everything here. Mini Pepper will just to kill the witch. Yes, okay. Wait a second. Okay. Good game. That one, that was a lot better than the previous one. But again, with Clash Royale being Clash Royale, different decks work different ways. Maybe I would have done better with the other deck. Maybe I could have got a 3 crown with it. By the way, let's just take a look. He, he had some high level cards. Like a level 6 Prince is actually pretty good. As well. The previous guy, we were up, we were up against quite an interesting deck there. Look at that. We have Golem. This. A Golem, a Mega Knight in the same deck. With a Pump as well and a Zap. You just don't get those too often. So you have four elixir, you don't get much swarm cards, which, which is a big problem. I like to use the guards quite a lot, considering like how I've got them up to level 6. I get very few cards up to level 6, like originally I used to use Goblin Barrel a lot with the Zap Bait, Log Bait meta. That was always why I used Goblin Barrel, but then that sort of died down. Magically I got a level 3 princess, 5 out of 10, hoping to get that to level 4. Nonetheless, I'll probably do one more game, just to see... We're, we're gonna change this up again, um... Instead of a hog... Hmm, how am I gonna do this? Okay, we're gonna use some of the... More interesting cards, I guess. I don't know where I'm going with this, we'll just put zappies in for... Electro, why don't, why don't we put two stun things in? Like, considering I don't have any spells... 
Stun is actually quite important in this. Again, I have a mini P.E.K.K.A. And, uh, uh, I guess I don't need the... The mini P.E.K.K.A came in... No, 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 okay. This is what we're going to be using. So... <clears throat> So this is what we got. Okay. A rather interesting move by him. Oh, no, that was a mistake. Oh, oh dear, I'm being too slow when it comes to reaction. So, oh my goodness, I denied so much value for myself. If you guys didn't see that, I could have easily fireballed the minions that are oh, dear. There was so much on the line there. And I will let it all go like a monkey. Ooh, that, that wasn't a bad log for him. Huh? Very well played. Oh, this is, oh no! That was a perfect Valkyrie placement. But as you can see, I, I make a lot of my mistakes, but I'm easily able to like tell what where I make mistakes and when. So it's annoying when I do make mistakes, considering like value is everywhere. I mean, what can you do? Oh, I don't think Zappy's range can reach that. I'm not too sure. We'll go with that and then Zappy over here just to see how they react. Oh my goodness, they just got ready. We're gonna get all of those real quick. And that will absolutely nothing. Yeah, this might be a quick L. Oh dear, no. Oh dear, oh no. Oh, the mistake. I always know, the back one is always going to be the last one to get here. I saw the one, the... Oh dear, so bad. Sorry you have to see this atrocious little gameplay. Oh no, that was a bit off to Basically there's a way of making the Valkyrie go backwards and it's a bit too late in placing the hog. To put it simply. And he's level 11 as well, so I have 300 more health and he's done more damage overall. So I need to be able to, okay, we'll put this Tesla down. My main is for choosing it so I can save Elixir for later. Two down the middle. Yeah. I don't care, I'm just going for five Oh, uh, okay, okay, He knows I have the five in so I'm sure he will find Okay, 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 we're gonna push. He decided to do something. That was, I mean, yeah, it's interesting. I mean, like, Oh yes, look at all those zappies going in there. And the Valkyrie, if Valkyrie had time, I'm sure he would have done a lot. Okay, and I have the looks of the That's the place where I went. Right, oh, you can't. Well, I mean, nothing you can do about the little but I know he's going to be like, I'm just going to be like, okay, I'll just go. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. The amount of thought that goes into every match in Clash Royale is why I'm still playing it. Two years straight. I hardly ever spend money on the game. I say hardly, that doesn't mean I don't. Oh, yeah, that was a bad place for me, but I still do it anyway. I think I'm just going to be defending the- Actually, actually, actually. Hmm. Now, I know what his plan is, is to push, right? So what if I do this? I'm going to fireball that, just so I don't hit the camera. I just wanted to... See what I got to do, okay. Well, hey, a win, a loss, and a draw. I will take it, considering I'm not an amazing player. Well, anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy that little match. I, I know I wasn't amazing, made a lot of mistakes. But here's our final product. I guess the deck before was good. I should have used it. But that is the 4 elixir challenge. <clears throat> oh, dear. It's just an idea I got from the quest. I did the 3 elixir challenge. Before quests were a thing, no, that's a lie. Quests were a thing. I was just doing it. But either way, I think Clash Royale's a great game. Shout out to Supercell. Please get the game. 
I want more people to play it. I don't want the game to die anytime soon. Anyway, like, subscribe, comment what you want me to do next. Probably that I'll do the five, but if anyone else has any ideas, I'm very open to listen out. And goodbye.